guys. Welcome to a morning in Gunnison. The sun's only just coming up there, you can see in the window behind me. But yeah, I slept pretty good. I slept from about 11 to about 4 a.m. Woke up and then went back to sleep. Got up at about 6, so I'm feeling pretty good. Ready for a day, for a new day. It's gonna be great. So we're heading out for a bit of shooting this morning. Alan wants to get a bit of practice and we I'm going to be heading on the buff hunt uh, tomorrow, Alan and I, to go and start setting up and scouting and stuff like that. So, I'm going to get out and do some shooting this morning. Um, it's pretty cold this morning. It's like it's 15 degrees Fahrenheit, which is probably like minus 10 Celsius. You can see on the window here all the like frost and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, pretty cold. Just going to drop off the higher car now and then <clears throat> do some shooting. I'll introduce you to some of the guys here, some of the family, um, but yeah, it's great to be here, great to be with the family and be back in Gunnison. It's a beautiful part of the world. So I'll show you guys around. <laughs> car is returned. I'm here with Andy. It's good to be back in Gunnison. We're getting ready for this bison hunt. Pretty excited. Um, I'm just on our way to the shooting range now to do some shooting with Alan so we can make sure everything's set for this hunt. Pretty stoked. Should be fun, eh? Looking forward to it. Yeah. The rest of the day packing and you guys will be out of here tomorrow morning. We've got a couple days to wrap things up at work and then, then we'll hit the road and get some scouting in and see if we can find a big ball. Yeah, it should be fun. It's gonna be awesome. It's, it was cold last night. Yeah, we hit eight degrees <coughs> here last night. We're in Gunnison, Colorado at the moment. <coughs> it's a little chilly. So head out to the range now quickly. And yeah, just throw a little pills down range and yeah and get ready for the rest of the day yeah it should be fun <laughs> good mick from australia alan chief, chief, chief buffalo hunter chief buffalo hunter <laughs> and then andy and i the porters yeah. <laughs> gun bearers gun bearers Done at the range here. Yeah? Alan's feeling confident in his rifle. What rifle is he using, Andy? It's a it's a Shiloh Quigley 45 110, um, which is a, an extended case of the 4570 that's pretty well known. Okay. Um, and it's kind of like a it's a breech block rifle, big heavy octagonal barrel. Um, we tried a couple of different loads and we ended up softening it a little bit it's an 80 grain load with a 500 grain hardened lead bullet throws that piece of lead as well it's incredibly powerful the kinetic energy on that thing must be insane can't get on those mountains now pops into a diner here with andy <laughs> got to got to do this while you're in the u.s what do we got here? Some hash brown, corned beef, and easy over eggs, which is the equivalent to soft, right? <laughs> I don't know. I always forget what, what to call things Cooked in the US. White. Cooked white. Soft, yeah. Okay, there you go. Looks good. And some biscuit. That's biscuit, which is basically scone. like a muffin or a scone. <laughs> Looks good though. <laughs> So 
So we are busy getting ready for the big hunt, getting fuel and cans and getting everything packed and stuff. Alan's just showing me around Andy and Joni's house here, which is pretty neat, and their property. So it's pretty cool to see. What's in there? Eh? Petrol or diesel? I don't know. This is diesel. Wow, well, this is the generator's diesel. And then they'll clad these walls eventually with something, but this is basically the the pan panel and it's got insulation in between. It's okay. sandwiched. And that's so that's the mud room. The bathroom. And then this is like, Look at this, I love this floor. Yeah, it's done a great job. See the arrows that Journey put here? Yeah, the, I saw them on her Instagram. Yeah. Me it's too. cool. The friends of ours did that. Straight and then this is the spare bedroom or Journey's, like Journey's room. Art room. Yeah, it's got a built in, going to be a built in closet there, and then here's a little pantry. Okay. And then the kitchen's here. Dining room and the bar. Uh, we just put that in just recently. And then if you go nice and warm in here, you can yeah, feel it's pretty cool. just from the sunshine. Yeah, I think we're going to find it. Well, in the really nice sun game. Basement. Yeah. This is going to be a great space as well. Yeah. So we've got, we've got in-floor heating and, and then we've got, these are all the solar batteries, then we go into that box up against there. Okay. And that's the water coming in from the, from the well. Okay. And pump it into here and then boost it into the house. Yeah. And then all the, all the, Pipes and, and down here will be mostly storage and yeah, reloading, bow, and yeah, all that stuff. <coughs> See how much soda you're going to get. Yeah, with the day. windows, yeah, the wood stove is nice, like the yeah, path. They fired it up the other day. That's cool. Yeah, nice views. I think they're going to put their bed up here. Yeah. yeah. Back in the bed, so Look at that. The view out there. Yeah. That's class. Looks great. There's a bunch of springs down there, so there's always water down in the far corner there running into the property. Okay. Yeah, I think the roof. Yeah. That's crazy how that's the thickness of the roof. That beam. Nice and insulated. Yeah. <coughs> Will they put railing up here? Yeah, they will eventually put a railing there. Looks great, eh? Yeah. A lot of work. Yeah, it's been a it's been a lot of work. It's been fun. Yeah. Especially with that. Let me check that. The deck. And the nice thing you'll be able to sit on this side in the morning and that side in the afternoon. Yeah, and it's going to be really comfortable. Just for <coughs> the guys watching this, this was all done from scratch by these guys. So Adeline was saying it was there was nothing here at all. Even that road you can see just coming in over there was nothing. They cut that out and built this from scratch. Very cool. Yeah, so you see that signal peak up there? Yeah. And Gunnison's just behind there. Okay. So they're seven miles from, from Gunnison. From yeah. Okay. That's cool. This is, this is very nice. Yeah, it's not even really super comfy. Yeah. But you can see the well right there. You see where the you see where the deer is. Uh -huh. Just in front of it, down diagonally down, there's a blue cap. Okay. That's the well. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. We reached it. Both Andy and I agreed. We 
55 feet, we hit a big break. Wow, that's cool. Plenty of water, which is nice. Yeah. You don't have to worry about it. And 55 feet is not deep, eh? No, it's nothing. That's the trouble with those wells, you know, you could be charging you per foot. They went down, they ended up at 80 feet just to give us a bit of a sum. Just going to get some supplies, batteries and a few other things that we need for the hunt, last minute things. It's a nice day, warming up a little bit. So I'm staying here with Ellen and Francie, who has this Beautiful gallery here. Open your eyes gallery. Ken Gunnison. It's beautiful. All of their photography. A lot of local artists. It's a beautiful spot. Anyone's over here? Just come check it out. spot or balcony thing up here, some chairs, sit and enjoy all this art, wildlife slash Africa section of islands here. Looks great. Beautiful. On a mission in the Bushy, what's it, a fuso? Fuso. Fuso. To get some propane. Today is a lot of running around and carting and packing and all the fun stuff to make a hunt happen. here to Tash and Jay's place. See where they're at. Hey guys. Hey. Hey you. This is Tash. How's it going Tash? Good, how are you? You're on my YouTube channel. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. Welcome. Feel that wood. Check it out. Yeah. Four wheat, four deep. Keep four deep. Dogs. Hey. <laughs> how long will that last you? The winter? Hopefully. <laughs> It's crazy. Yeah, we have more wood this year than we've ever had. Usually we're scrounging, but we at the end of the still have a bunch of rounds because we replaced some of the shorter ones from our fence and oh, okay. made you know. Oh, did you burn that? Yeah. Burn those last year? <laughs> yeah. No, oh. we just had some short ones, oh. and I wanted them tall, so we replaced some of the short ones. But we have that is our backup wood pile. Nice. Yeah. So it's it's cool. Yeah. I always enjoy your living room, Tash. There's so much cool stuff Full to look stuff. at. Beautiful spot, yeah. Oh, Do you still get... The ditches are off right now, but... Okay. There's a little bit of water that stays in this one, and then over the, that thing, there's a nice river. And the chickens. Oh, your chickens. Some scrap pots that are all melting. And your veggie garden. It's looking very... It's very... Very bare. Dead right now. <laughs> ready but ready for the winter. Plant garlic. My second lot of garlic in, but... Yeah, that, this bed right here was the first bed that I planted my garden yeah. in, and now it's this big. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's but, cool. Yeah, it was good. We got tons and tons of food. Yeah, it was fun watching your Instagram. Yeah. I enjoyed watching your Instagram. It was good fun. Seeing all your stuff. Just back at the gallery here. It's great to see Tash and see her and Jay's little spot, what they've been up to there. Um, now we're going to be packing and getting stuff ready for leaving tomorrow. Got an early start tomorrow, so we need to get everything in and ready to go. My, 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 
Yeah, I'll chase upstairs and sleep on it. You ready to go? Uh, other than that, we pretty much good to Well, go. and we got this area here too, as long as yeah. we have stuff that's easy to remove. Yeah. Okay, so you're gonna get some plugs. Get I've plugs. I've got the tools. A couple more things for fuel for the lamp. Yeah. And just, just, yeah. I reckon a couple of those green ones and we will be good. And what is this for? There's no leaves. This I don't, I don't the, use uh, this stuff anyway. So that, yeah, so it's really much. only those, and I'd leave those till tomorrow. Sure. That's what I didn't mean there. Sure. I think everything else is about done. I've got that little buddy here as well that we'll take. Sounds good. If it's cold, we'll knock. Yeah. You, have, you have heard the IV motto, family yeah. motto. What's that, Francis? Leave nothing behind? <laughs> no, I can't remember now. No, no you don't. <laughs> Why? Any, any any damn, damn, <coughs> two, two mottos. Any damn fool can be uncomfortable. If they want to. And then the other, the other is why be difficult when with just a little more effort you can be bloody impossible. <laughs> <laughs> so now you know what kind of two is. <laughs> 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 Good luck, Randy. <laughs> oh, I, believe me, I'm fine. I have a good sense of humor. <laughs> uh, hey guys, it's been a great day here. It's been super busy getting stuff ready for our hunt in Utah in the Henry Mountains. But I believe early tomorrow morning we'll be getting up probably like half four and then leaving here at about six in the morning. Got a bunch of packing and stuff to do in the morning, but yeah been pretty hectic getting stuff ready today but I think we're just about there you can see I've got a bunch of stuff going on in here got my backpack and a few other things sorted out over here so yeah I'm good to go I'm gonna hit the sack now and get some sleep but uh, yeah we'll catch you guys in the morning for a really cool adventure. Cheers.